Yo, what's going on guys, Shinny got me here, and uh, yeah, I'm back with another Dragon Guide. Now, uh, if you guys aren't familiar, the Dragon Guides are where I show you guys how to play and encounter certain characters and all the other stuff, and show some DND tech as well. Um, I'm going to show my credentials right here, so you guys, you know, know who I am, number one DND on Xbox, number one DND globally, and player kills, all that, yeah, yada, 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 I don't care about this stuff. Anyways, let's get into the guide. This is my good friend, Lady Sid... Any, uh, sure, yeah, let's go with that. That's your name. She's here to uh, be Hito while I show you guys TND stuff. Let's go over things. You guys know Hito. Everybody hates Hito. We all hate Hito. So one thing you should know first is if you uh, or if a Hito Kiri throws their chain light and you dodge it, you get a free guard break. Now you might be wondering, uh, since when do Hitos throw lights? When they're really desperate, to be honest. So hit me with a chain light and I'll dodge it. As you can see. My controller did not let me guard break. Okay, do that again. <laughs> there we go. Free guard break. Now, like I said before, when a Hito is really desperate, they will do that. Uh, usually they don't. Uh, but yeah, that option is very well there. Another thing, speaking about lights, if a Hito throws a light attack at you and then goes into the kick, you can light them out of that. So throw a light attack at me and then go for kick. Looks just like that. Do it again. Yep, just like that. Uh, this part that I'm going to mention here, I mean, kind of, it would be kind of hard to demonstrate. I mean, you guys just kind of know. But when you're fighting Hito, the main thing is to just make reads. If you're trying to react to Hito Kiri, you're playing incredibly wrong. You need to make reads because, you know, all this charge stuff, yeah, like that. Uh, I'm, you're supposed to guess between the level 3, like that or the level 1, or the level 2, where they like partially hold it, and same with the kick and sweep, you're not gonna react to that. So, don't even try. Legit, just read. That's, I mean, you can probably react to the lights, yeah, but the problem is Hitokiri players don't throw lights, so you're gonna be reading those heavies and the uh, kick, sweep, and all that for uh, the majority of your fight with Hitokiri. So if y'all didn't know, I didn't mention this before because I thought this was kind of self-explanatory. <laughs> If you dodge a Hitokiri's kick or their uh, sweep or whatever, you get a free uh, guard break. So, obviously I did not read in time, <laughs> but if I did, then I would get a free guard break. Ouchies. That can be variable timed as well. There you go, free guard break. Another thing you can do is, this isn't for the sweep or kick by the way. So if a Hitokiri is like attacking and then you light like as they're charging their heavy and dodge um, as they're like throwing it, then you can get a free guard break. So I'm going to try to demonstrate it. There we go. I actually got that first try on camera. Wow. Crazy. Usually this doesn't go that well. Well, when I'm recording things, this doesn't go that well. I can do it like as much as I want in live game. Anyways, back to the guide. So I know some of you guys, when you're fighting Hito, you're doing panic dodge heavies to try to like get around everything. And you kind of need to be careful with those. So do like uh, the heavy chain stuff on me. Yeah, you need to be very careful because stuff like that will happen. I did an empty dodge there, but the same can happen if you're, you know. That was a successful, successful. I messed that word up so bad. That was successful, but like, sometimes it won't be so successful. So, yeah. So just keep throwing them at me. Just keep throwing level 1s or 2s, whatever you want to do. Yeah, that can also happen as well. Because if you do one thing wrong, this could go... Yeah, that can happen. So you just need to be very careful. And really watch what the Hito is doing. Sometimes you might run out of stamina. Uh, that will happen. That's when you just kind of stop dodging. But if a Hito Kiri is throwing like level 2s and stuff at you... One thing you can do is palm strike if you know it's coming. That doesn't cover the level 1, only the level 2 and the level 3. Level 3 being the charge. Also, this goes for the, you know, kick and stuff as well. So, yeah, I'll use that. That kind of puts us in the uh, segment of if a Hito carry is... This is more so on a read. Like I said before, you need to be, like, read-based against Hito. If you know, like, something slow is coming. So, like, charge up a heavy or whatever. And I didn't do anything. Okay, charge up a heavy again. If you know that's coming, then you can interrupt that with a palm strike. Now do a level two. Do it again. Now you have to be earlier on a level two. If you try to do level two like on read, it's just simply not going to work. Or at least it hasn't for me. But uh, yeah, it's more so gonna have to be read. So I should mention like any other character, you know, if they do a dodge attack after your kick, you can, you know, crush and counter it. So I'll 
Show that here. Just dodge that, my kick. Well, not that at all. <laughs> yeah, it's just that, really. Same with Bomb Strike. Alright, so as far as, like, tips and tricks, that's about all I have, uh, for right now, at least. Uh, one thing I regret not having is, like, hit stun stuff. I don't have a lot of hit stun stuff, really, to be honest. Unless it's, like, TNDs or, like, Highlanders or Kenseis. So, if somebody does, then please drop that uh, in the comments i don't even know where to go to find it i don't even talk to for honor people so yeah if anybody knows that stuff please drop it in the comments and if you have any other tips please drop those in the comments as well but i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope this helped uh, if you guys want to get in contact with me i got links to my instagram tiktok and discord in the description below in the discord we got the cries for help section in case you guys are going through something and need someone to talk to we got the meme section in case you guys want to drop some memes and we even have the training room in case you guys want to figure out how to play and encounter certain characters also misoh he may help me edit and come up with uh, some ideas for a lot of this dragon guide stuff so thank you misoh he may and uh yeah that's about it for today uh the next dragon guide will probably be shugoki whenever i get everything together and i mean if anybody has hits done stuff then yeah tell me that but uh yeah embrace your dreams and protect your honor shinigami out y'all